I was told we had to get rid of Donald Trump because we needed someone decent, a good person, uh, uh, an old man who, who couldn't possibly be mean to anyone. Then why did Biden say this about a reporter who just wanted an answer to some questions? Would you take President Biden's picture back? Do you think it plays with the political liability? That's a great asset. More inflation. What a stupid son of a bitch. So there you have it, radical leftist. You wanted a decent man, you got someone even worse. Because the benefit of Trump is he tells you exactly what he's thinking, but this Biden guy told you he's a nice, decent, old grandpa, couldn't possibly do anything wrong, and this is what he says about people behind their back. Do you want the guy who tells you how he feels to your face? or the guy who's tricking you and talks about you behind your back. I guess how you answer that will depend on how comfortable you are with yourself and facing people in intense business situations. Mr. Excuse President, me. that's enough. Mr. President, I had one other Peter, question, if I may ask, on, on the Russia investigation. Are you concerned that, that you may have I'm not concerned about anything with you the Russian investigation because it's a hoax. Are you, that's enough. Put down the mic. Do you want it straight or do you want it leftist style? What a stupid son of a bitch. Who would say a thing like that? I have incredibly good judgment. One, I married Jill. And two, I appointed Johnson to the Academy. I just want you to know that. Just clap for that, you stupid bastard. Only an animal would say a thing like that. Biden quickly became agitated when Fallon didn't agree to support him in the caucuses. We gotta stop building and replacing pipelines. You gotta go vote for somebody else. All right, thanks so much, sir. Guys, we're gonna have you Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Prime. I'm gonna vote you in the general if you treat yeah. me. First surprise is that Biden told Fallon to vote for someone else. And then he presses on Fallon's chest, pokes him with a finger, and finally grabs his jacket with two hands. It was not appropriate interaction for anybody. I mean, if I'd done that to him, the security would have been all over me. Actively trying to diminish our Second Amendment right and take away our guns. You're full of All right, thank now, you guys. Now, no, shush. Shush. They know when you said you're going to take our guns. I did blood. not say that. That's yeah. not true. I did That's not say that. a viral video. Well, it's a viral video like the other ones are putting out that are simply alive. Your, your voice, you said that you're taking the guns. Well, he just video. clarified it. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Hey, take thing. the AR. Your AR-14s are what we Okay, did. this is not okay. Hold on, hold on. All right. Hey, let's you keep don't tell me to do that. I want to go outside. There's a lot of guys. Hey, you're, a lot of guys want me, man. I'm hey, not hey, working. Hey, hey, hold on. Give me a break, man. Don't be such a worry about it. You're pushing up on me. Hey, there's a lot of guys. Hey, hey, hey. Speak to Joe. Look, here's the deal. Here's the deal. Only an animal would say a thing like that. Hey, I'm going on tour. Miami, Arizona. We have Reno, Nevada. Don't forget Manhattan, Tampa, Naples, Florida, and five other cities, including Raleigh, North Carolina. Be there. Thank you.